Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new Supreme Ruler Let's Play as Hungry. Finally a new Let's Play is about to start here. I've been doing Versus as you guys may recall from my previous videos. Versus 2.0 as I like to call it since it's my return again to YouTube officially uploading Supreme Ruler content. But I haven't uploaded any type of Let's Play whatsoever yet so... I was thinking about doing Hungary. I don't remember if I've ever done a Let's Play for Hungary, major or minor wise. I should have checked beforehand, but you know what? It's going to be a brand new Let's Play, a minor Let's Play. This will only be a minor Let's Play, by the way. I haven't decided on a major country to play as yet. Again, Russia has been or is being requested but I'm still on the fence about that currently if it does get more support and garner more people to support it then I'll probably do it but for now Hungary being a minor let's play I'm not sure what my goal is right now for Hungary um, I still need to make alliances and do a bunch of other things first here and there but um, I guess I can start off with trying to enact Slovakia up north and then headed for Austria. I guess we can kind of reform the the hung the Austro-Hungarian Empire. I don't I feel like I have done a let's play for Hungary before. Maybe during Supreme Lord of the Great War. That was during World War 1, so maybe that was different. Yeah, but probably during that game, but that was World War 1. So I'm going to try to see if I can bring back the Austro-Hungarian Empire here in Supreme Ruler Ultimate as Hungary, of course, and see how far I get trying to bring back the glory of the Austro-Hungarian Empire. I still can't believe you guys enjoy videos like this, but hey, <laughs> that's cool. All right, so um, I know you guys don't want me to keep saying this. I know I got to keep beating a dead horse. But sometimes you do. I, I, I've never done that in my entire life, okay? <laughs> it's just a joke, okay? But uh, it's just a phrase that I made up. If you want to see your nation, if you want to support me on Patreon, there's a link below. It means a lot, and it gives me more motivation to upload new Let's Plays, new verses, and your nation. And, of course, I'll give you a shout-out. So... There's a link below to that, and I apologize for trying to repeat myself and keep saying that. Don't worry, I won't be saying that any longer. Maybe one or two more videos, and after that, I'll probably forget about it, because I think all of you have already heard enough about my Patreon. It's the way for me to continuously upload videos and get that motivation going. Otherwise, work will kill me, and I will never want to upload Supreme Ruler videos again after I just came back. Alright, so first things first. Alliances. I've already decided. Uh, Germany will be my first ally. And Bulgaria will be my second. And after that, that's about it. No other alliances. Maybe I could make an alliance with Greece, honestly. Uh, so you know what? For now, I'll make a non-aggression pact with them. And a full transit treaty. Blah, blah. You know what? Let's do this. I'm not going to make an alliance with Greece. But I'm just going to make some treaties with them. Russia. I also need some other units here. Or not units, but design. Which is the... Uh, which is actually not here. <laughs> the Vodnik. The Vodnik is what I usually try to build. Even though the Vodnik unit... Vodnik unit, excuse me, is very low tech and is destroyed easily by other units. Not as advanced as other infantry vehicles. Uh, what I lack in quality, I can make up in quantity with those Vodnik units. But it looks like I cannot buy them from Russia because they usually do show up. Is it because of my tech level? I mean... I don't know how long how long does this take to build days to build 32 the Vodnik usually takes like 14 days to build that's why I want something quick to build 30 
27, 25. BT. Where is the Vodnik at? That's strange because Russia definitely has the Vodnik and I for some reason cannot get that Vodnik. Oh, wait, hang on. Do this first. There we go. I'm also going to try to keep the video 15 minutes or less as well. I keep trying to do that, but I always go overboard beyond 20 minutes, but I'm going to try my best to keep it below 15 minutes. Even if I don't go to war in this part, this is just a debut of a new Let's Play, by the way. So if you don't see any action, any war, which is what everyone likes for some reason, strange to say the least, um... It's just the first part, guys. I just want to see how it goes. I want to see your reaction, your comments, what you think about it. So let me know in the comments below. This is just a start, okay? Greece. For some reason, Greece did not accept my offers. Um, okay, I'll just do non-aggression pack, full transit treaty. That's it. Can you do? A, can you at least do that, Greece? Please. Yeah, I guess that worked. Yep, it did. Um. Oh my gosh, the tips is back. Oh my gosh, that is so annoying. Stop. I want some non-aggression packs with France and a couple of other nations, so that way I don't get destroyed by any of them. Italy, yes, I'll do Italy as well. There we go. Um, Turkey, uh, I don't think Turkey will work out. Romania, Poland. <laughs> I mean, that's about it, honestly. Oh, Switzerland. There we go. I'll do a full transit treaty with them, too. Why not? I hear wars breaking out. Moldova. What's going on? China, China. Oh, it's just China. Getting down to business. Oh, wow, look at that. Sure. Sure. Get out of my face. I hope the audio level is okay as well. I've been checking back in the videos and uh, my voice is very loud. It's because of the mic. It's very crystal clear. Razor, of course. But I try to turn up the music a bit since there is, it doesn't sound like there's music coming through the, uh, through the video. So I turned it up a bit and hopefully my voice can still be heard. Nepal has been eliminated by China. No surprises there. Speaking of China, my last video, China vs. India, was not a success. <laughs> uh, to say the least, if I say so myself, it definitely was not that much of a success. Not that I care about it, but again, what I need is more support so that I can see and continue to upload Supreme Ruler videos what is going on here? Hold up. Oh gosh. There we go. Stutter. Turkey has declared war on Greece. Condemn. Okay, you know what? Just because of that happened, you know, um You know what? I'll make an alliance with stupid tips. Just because that happened, I'll make an alliance with Greece. I wasn't planning on it, but just because Turkey attacked Greece, I'm going to do it. All right, there's that. Actually, what kind of units do you have? Light infantry, how long does that take? Fifth, wait, what? 19 days, okay, I'll take the light infantry. Screw it, right? I can build those in just 19 days if I can't get the Vonix from Russia. There we go, $81 million, enjoy it. <laughs> tanks, on the other hand, I don't think I get, I mean, I could get tanks, but do I want tanks? How long does it take to build? 97, 88, yikes, 48. Yeah, I don't think about, uh, what the heck, man? Turn all this off. All right, turn all that off and then remove that, there we go. Well, good luck to you, Greece. North, North Korea, Kuwait, Timber, why not? Actually, what I need is oil. That's always important. So you know what? Let me do this real quick. Let's see. I'll give Saudi Arabia two billion. How much can I get from them, though? 
see if we can get oh there we go 10 10 million barrels 10 billion barrels something like that all right now we need to deploy our units I've got 117,000 reserves. That should be enough. Air support. Don't need him yet. Garrison's here. Garrison's here. Garrison's here. Along our borders just in case they do try to attack us. I wish I could get a non-aggression pack with Ukraine as well. I, uh, I really don't want to go to war with them either. But it looks like that's not going to work. Dang it. Still deploying units? Yes. Where's your capital? Oh, it's up there. Alright. Budapest. Oh, nice. They put the gears in just for me. Let's put another one in there. Alright, that should do. Let's open two fronts here, shall we? Oh, and I also I need to start building my units before I forget. My goodness, I'm so behind. I'm sorry. I know. Got to get used to everything again. So this will take 32 days to build. 19 days. 19 days. Okay, so which one? 18, 12, 18, 12. 14. They're both the same, just different designs between the light infantry uh, unit designs. I'll go with the Humvee because, you know, Humvees are cool and I prefer Humvees. Let's do that. Can I build one of those? That's recon, screw it. Actually, you know what, I can build another of those too. Let's do that. There we go, all right. Artillery, artillery. Let's see, when should we start this war against Slovakia? How much time do I have left? Dang, already 12 minutes? All right, so February 15th, let's do it. Let's see how this goes. Oops. All right. I hope this isn't a failure. This is a new Let's Play, so it begins. Or open a second front here. Your capital cities over there. Actually, I don't even want to destroy their units. I want to keep them for myself, actually. I'm going to have to sacrifice some of my units here, though, sadly. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Captured. And next. Alright, there we go. Alright, that's all I needed to do in the first part. But, um, anyways, in case you're wondering, I know that there's other... Uh, modes, victory modes, victory types, I should say, in Supreme Ruler. But I, and I think like 90% of Supreme Ruler players stick with the uh, the capital victory type, as you can see. And it's because if you leave it incomplete, which I'll say is interesting and hectic, it's just going to take in real life probably weeks or even months heck even years just imagine a decade <laughs> to uh take over well i wouldn't say a decade that's a little bit too far but it'll take years just to annex a country especially say like russia or the u.s a huge country like those uh i am not ever gonna play on the complete victory type the capital victory type is enough for me and I like to get things done very quickly. So there we go. Slovakia, Slovakia has been annexed. My first nation in this new, brand new minor Let's Play with Hungary. Um, really didn't take that. Or really, it really didn't take that. It really, excuse me. ADHD, calm down. Calm down. It didn't take that long to enact Slovakia. 20 unit kills, 14 unit losses. Mm. It could have been better, but it's whatever. It's because of the capital city, Bratislava. I was being like 
attacked by their fabrication or their base there up north. And then let's check the view empire feature real quick. There we go. That's how Hungary looks like. My next target will definitely be Austria. For sure. But um, I think this is where the first part of Hungary will end. It's already been almost 15 minutes in the timer. Leave your suggestions. Leave your comments on what you think about this brand new Let's Play with Hungary. Again, this is just a minor Let's Play. It's just a first part. More videos to come. Major Let's Plays should arrive soon with a different country. I haven't decided yet. But again, if you want to support me on Patreon, that means a lot. Even more support is better. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys in the next video.